Why does my rice not cook perfectly? Why does my rice turn out clumpy? These are the most commonly asked questions about cooking rice. And today I'm going to be showing you a trick to make the perfect fluffy rice. I'm using basmati rice. So you're going to wash until the water turns out clear. Always wash your rice. After washing my rice for around two times, this is how the rice looks like and it's nice and clean. So step number one for cooking fluffy rice is to always use a heavy bottomed pot or sufuria. So I'm going to place my sufuria over high flame. For this recipe, I'm using two cups of basmati rice. So I'm going to add in four cups of water to my pot. Carefully transfer in your rice in the pot. And step number three is to add in your seasoning. So I have some salt and two tablespoons of cooking oil. Stirring the salt into the water. Then you're going to let your pot come to a boil. So I used a cup to measure my rice and for one cup of rice, you're going to add in two cups of water. So because I've used two cups of rice, I'm going to be adding in four cups of water. When the water is halfway reduced, you're going to pick your spatula and stir in to make sure the oil is evenly distributed in the rice. Then you're going to let the water reduce once more. Once the water is fully reduced, you're going to cover and reduce the flames to low and slowly cook your rice for around five minutes. This process is going to fully cook the rice because we have cooked the rice halfway. Whenever you're cooking rice, always go for the best quality if you want the best results. For me, I love using basmati rice, as I've said, and it always turns out perfect. I'm using the short grain basmati rice. You can also use the long grain basmati rice. After five minutes, I'm going to check on my rice. And this is how the rice looks like. You're going to use a fork and fluff up your rice. So this is how I always make basic white rice for my family every single time with those three basic steps. So I'm going to be serving my rice for lunch over some stew and it's going to be totally delicious.